YouTube, Shuki here. And Kate and Perry. And we did something pretty stupid. Uh, <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's just our life. So, um, well, okay, you know the Dollar Tree pack. So one dollar, you get three cards. You could get something really cool. You could get something really absolutely crappy. You don't really know. But um, I'm not sure if anyone's actually done this before. Uh, I went there today. And they had just put the Steam Siege set out. And, well, that happened. <laughs> this right here is a complete box of the Steam Siege Dollar Tree packs. 120 packs. Yep, you can do the math. This is an expensive video. But it's all in the name of science. Yeah. No. N no. Uh, no. It's all in the name of Pokemon. There's no science involved in this crap. And science. No, no. So, <laughs> needless to say, I spent a lot of money, but we will find out once and for all how good a complete box of this stuff is. Now, keep in mind that a normal booster box of cards, hi Zeus, is about $90 to $100, depending on where you pick it up from. So this right here was $120, so we'll kind of compare... Uh, normal box pull ratios with what we got uh, in here and see just how good getting this actually is. So uh, we got a lot to get through. So without further ado, let's go ahead and just kind of uh, start plucking out of here. Um, gonna go by as quickly as possible with these. Uh, right off the bat, we got a reverse evil tall, which is very, very nice. Uh, here is the little ad card just for play Pokemon, and then on this side for... Is that TCG? No, it's not even TCG. Oh, it's just TCG. Alright, so I'm just going to set everything good over here. Cat's over here. She's going to sleeve anything that is reverse hollow or hollow or anything of the like. Uh, Nino King. It's not awful. I need to remember glare going on here. Um, I'll set the rares aside too, just for kicks. It doesn't need to be sleeved, but I'll set them aside. X, Y, the series, same thing right there. This is so exciting. Uh, nothing in this one. Pokemon TV app. So we started off strong. I'm not even sure what I'm really hoping for in these. Um... Nothing too crazy there. Uh, some Volcanians would be nice. Both the Basics and the EXs. Oh, Reverse Nose Pass. A Klefki. So set that Nose Pass aside. And if I accidentally forget a rare, um, I apologize. And oh yeah, you see that corner. You see it. You see it all the people out there. Which one is it? Which one is it? Are we going to do a guess? Are we going to do a guess? I'm going to say Talonflame. Hydreigon. Ooh. <laughs> so that's really cool. We got a break. So we've opened barely any packs, and we already have a absolutely awesome Hydreigon break, a card that I really haven't seen in action yet. Um, I've been... Uh, Lacking in watching uh, Steam Siege deck builds, but we'll see how that goes. All right, in this pack we have nothing of utmost importance. Like I was saying before, Hydreigon Break totally uh, screwed me up. If uh, I accidentally miss a rare or something like that, I do apologize. Um, I know most of the rares in this set, but a couple might slip past my radar. Here is a Reverse Fletchinder. Not particularly good, but hey, it's a reverse. That's part of this experiment here, this very expensive experiment. A reverse Rapidash. Nice. So after our really big flub up with uh, Fates, Fates just gave us absolutely crap Dollar Tree packs. We're kind of back to that pull ratio of getting a lot of reverse hollows, which is pretty neat. There's another one, a reverse Lampent this time. So like I said in previous uh, Dollar Tree videos, like these are great for reverse holo collectors because you're pretty much paying a dollar and getting a reverse holo almost automatically uh, in a lot of cases. 
a Meryl and a Zoomeril in one pack. Is a Zoomeril not a rare? No, it's not uncommon. That was a rare. So I thought it was fun. So let's see. Right now we got a break to our name. And nothing in this pack right here. But we still got a lot of packs to I don't go. Think hit 20 yet. I don't think so. <laughs> Uh, Moongus. Take a break and dump out the trash. Yeah, that is a rare right there. Um, right before I end this video, I'm going to go through the stack real quick just to make sure. I'm sorry, I just punched you guys. I hope I punched you guys again. Poor YouTubers. <laughs> a Ninja Boy. That's pretty cool. Set aside trainers. Still too. can't use them inside of online. Yeah, well. <laughs> <laughs> Since when has online ever been a. Uh, prepared for anything ever. That was a greedy dice. Oh, thanks. Again, not good. Uh. There is a couple trainers in that pile that I didn't set aside. I see something shiny. Is it an EX? Is it a break? Or is it the wrapper? Is it just a reverse hollow? Magirna EX! And Cash just holding out her hand expectedly. A uh, very beautiful card, and actually a really good card. If you run a deck that doesn't specifically need certain types of energy cards, Magirna is actually really good because you can run Metal, and then those Pokemon are now immune to effects of attacks, which is a really nice uh, little bonus there. So there's a Reverse Nidorino. I think we did we get a Nidorino already? Not a Reverse. Remember. Oh. Maybe a regular. I don't know things. There's a Braviary. There's a Braviary is cool. I like him. Alright, so we're at an EX and a break. I do love Magirna a lot. Like I said, if you run a deck that can we use metal energy, you might as well toss a Magirna in there and give it a go. So nothing in that pack. You missed three. Yeah, well, nobody's perfect. There's a reverse Dino. Dano? Danish? What? No. no. I don't know. <laughs> Eat him. <laughs> Maybe it tastes good. Nom nom nom. Oh, card drum. Don't eat the card. Oh boy. You can kind of tell what that is just by looking at the corner there. It is Mega Gardevoir EX. Get that thingy out of the way. And a Halucha. I thought you were a rare too. I'm all over the place. But that is very nice. One of the dual type cards in this set, a fairy psychic type. God, it's so pretty. Uh, a really interesting attack, Spare Ray. Uh, clears, you can clear out your bench and do like 10 plus for yeah. each. Yeah, it's Dumb. interesting. It's an interesting mechanic. I just don't see it being that good. Its base damage is only 120. 10. Or 110, rather. That's even worse. Uh, and you're only adding 10. So it's not uh, all that great in the grand scheme of things, but it is a very pretty card. Volcarona there is a rare, so we'll set Volcarona aside. Reverse Sneasel and a special charge. Special charge is always nice, and we got the reverse Sneasel with Neon Roll. Hi Zeus. And Zeus has decided to shake and walk away. He'll be back in a moment. Decided to be obnoxious. Alright, reverse clauncher. A lot of reverses already. Yeah, um, and like I said, it's interesting because uh, the Fates video, I did two Fates videos, I think. Three. I, I think, uh, well, yours. I did one. I, did I do two? Yeah. Ooh, a Talonflame, who actually, at the time of this recording, very much shot up in price <laughs> uh, because of the Greninja deck and Worlds using it. Uh, a lot of people were like, oh, let's use Talonflame. And so now, like, I saw a Talonflame on eBay uh, that my friend from League pointed out to me for, like, $7.50. It was absolutely absurd uh, for just a normal rare card. Avalogs are rare. So we're getting a pretty good amount of rares. He's going nuts. <laughs> We'll let him calm down. Okay, he's finally laying down. For now, anyway. <laughs> so let us continue with that. Uh, normal clauncher. Nothing there. 
decided to clean up the area while we were pausing. So now I have room to dump these. Ooh. Again. Oh, you oh, see oh. the shiny. That is most definitely a break, but which break is it? You gonna guess? Ooh. I'm gonna still go with Talonflame again. Another oh Hydreigon break! <laughs> <laughs> Uh, so we are all over getting the Hydra Pokemon over there, but hey, uh, what, is, what does he even do? Uh, Calamity Blast, 150, discard 3 energy, attach this Pokemon. Uh, this attack does 50 30, damage to two, two of your Pokemon. Bench Pokemon. It's not too bad, it just, it's a lot to kind of do at once. But Alright, so we're at two breaks, despite them being the same exact one. <laughs> and two EXs and a ton of packs to go, so we're not doing too shabby at all if I don't say so myself. Do say so? I don't know. Words, English, etc. I don't say so myself. I don't know. I just realized it's very dark in this corner. Do you want me to? Over here. There we go. <laughs> Alrighty. Uh, nose pass. Yippee. Hip hip ray for nose pass. So. Well, we're kind of on the road here of not very good cards. Uh, can you imagine, like, the look on the lady's face when I went up to the register with the entire box of cards? She she said, oh, wow! A full art Magirna <gasps> EX. Yay! Uh, Cat really wants to play Magirna. <laughs> and oh, that's a really pretty card. Look at that. Kind of already talked about Magirna, so I'll kind of leave it at that, but just bathe in the majestic rainbow shine of Magirna. <laughs> this is my card. <laughs> well, it goes in my set. No, no, my you, card. Get the, you get the normal one. <laughs> no, no, my card. <laughs> and she's like, oh, are you buying me out of Pokemon cards? I said, yeah. <laughs> Reverse Persian. Pretty nice. Uh... And then my wallet cried a little bit when the total came up, <laughs> even though I told you see it, no. you see it. It's a full art. Magirna. We did it again. Yeah. Another Magirna! Yeah. Oh my god! <laughs> 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 this set, this box is full of all of the same stuff. We almost pulled two Magirna back to back, almost. Oh wow. Okay. There. Okay, that one's your card. No, 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 both of them are cards. No, they go in my deck. <laughs> you don't need two Magirna in a deck. Everybody needs Magirna in the deck. Another reverse Nidorino. Oh my God. Okay. So. <laughs> so excited, man. So regardless, uh, it was a very fun experience. I almost said experiments. That's what we're doing here. Technically, we are. So not too bad. Look at all the packs we still have to go to. Uh, so uh, we we definitely this could end up being absolutely worth it. I mean I know we're getting like duplicates of these EXs, but I'm more or less just kind of looking at what we're getting, not any like. Heck yeah, supercharge and special charge. Eh, close enough. I still need it. So <laughs> <laughs> I, I I got enough special charges to last. This it's fine. <gasps> Boom! Gardevoir EX to go with the Mega Gardevoir EX. She's already getting grabby, guys. Uh, the very awesome Link Blast and Luminous Blade Gardevoir. Uh, the old Gardevoir is still really good despite uh, losing uh, Romatisse. Uh, and that one is pretty interesting as well. Like I said, I'm not a big fan of the new Mega, but the new normal Gardevoir is pretty good. So. Gardevoir EX, the Link Blast is kind of decent, but you have to match the energy and it starts getting nifty after a little bit. And you can only do 100 with it anyway. <laughs> Especially if you're reversing Yan Mega. Yeah. Good luck matching that. <laughs> Alright, nothing in that pack. But you know what happens when you get a couple nothings. Something big pops out. Hope I just punched you guys again. You just <laughs> YouTubers. Well, I'm working with very little space here. Uh, and awesome, another Talon Flame. Neat. So I think I'm up to a full play set of Talon Flames, I believe. Not that I really plan on really using Talon Flame ever, but it's nice to have. Just you should in have case. at least four because I pulled two at least from the. Pyros are rare. Yeah, it is. 
haven't actually seen a whole lot of this guy in my pack openings thus far. Neat artwork, at the very least. Yeah, I pulled two of them Ooh, in the That's the wrong stack. Release. So, you should have four at least. Power Break is pretty interesting. I've seen that played with the uh, Vulcanian, but I haven't actually played it myself. We shall see. Alright. Real question is how long is this video gonna be? <laughs> Ashawat and Nadua in the same pack. I'm gonna say it's gonna be about an hour. Oh, jeez. <laughs> I'm so sorry, everyone. Then I'll hit the comments with, uh, why didn't you do, do different parts? Because that's not how I roll. I don't do parts. You're in it for the long haul, guys. Okay. Plus, you can pause it and go make yourself a sandwich and then come back. Or eat Krispy Kreme Donuts. A Dredagon. That's pretty cool. And another Halucha. Halucha. With Sudden Cyclone. Halucha. Which is basically just Lysander and an ability. <laughs> uh, so we're doing actually pretty good so far. Honestly, I'm surprised. Nothing there. Steelix Spirit Link. I mean, our stack of reverses are like almost starting to tip over. <laughs> Which, like I said earlier, oh, uh, uh, no, I almost said full art. That's stupid. Uh, this is our, actually our first normal holographic card. I've uh, gotten a lot of reverses, we've gotten full arts, we've gotten EXs, we've gotten breaks, but this is our first normal hollow. So pretty cool. Uh, just a reprint of the Oblivion Wing XY Evil Tall that's gotten reprinted lord knows how many times at this point. I think that's the third or fourth different artwork for it. Uh, but uh, still, even to this day, a really, really awesome solid card. So there's a reverse Yan Mega, Yanma rather, and a, another special charge. Special charge. I don't know what that was. Like, whenever I see special charge, the Gokaiger voice just pops into my head. From the, uh, the Galleon Buster. I don't know if anyone actually, like, I know some of you guys know what I'm talking about. My main Pokemon people probably don't know what I'm ta talking about. But I don't even know what I'm talking about. I thought of scanning <laughs> charge. That's what the voice I was doing was. Stunning Judge! That's what I was doing. I mixed everything up. Yes, you did. <laughs> do, 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 a fungus! A mungus! <laughs> That's a joke. Fungus has that. Is, is it Fungus, I think, that has that ability with the Pokeball? I think. It's really weird. No, Fungus, not a Mungus. Oh, I don't I think know. it's a Mungus. I don't know. One of them has some, like, attack where you can, like, get a Pokeball back from your discard pile or something. It's not a Mungus, so. Alright, that one got a little bit bent. But that's fine. There was nothing good in that pack. <laughs> All right, we got a reverse. It is La Vesta on the wings of La Vesta. La Vesta even have wings? No, he's just got little, little like. La Vesta kind of looks like a like cotton spore with those little red strips that Taco Bell puts in some of their stuff. That's what he looks like. <laughs> <laughs> he, he does. <laughs> we got a captivating Pokey Puff. Uh, which is a pretty interesting card. Uh, you have to have your opponent put down basic Pokemon that they have in their hand. Uh, so if they're holding on to that Hoopa or that Shaman uh, to play down later, or just a basic they don't want to put down, they like have for, to. Like for Yan Mega deck? I guess so, speaking of. Here is Yan Mega, oh, which okay. is great. I need some Yan Mega breaks, though. I could use... Uh, like, not Hydreigon and Morion Mega. That would be pretty <laughs> awesome. Don't really need Hydreigon Break. <laughs> wow, Xerneas to go with that Evil Tall. Um, I really like this artwork for Xerneas. Um, again, it is just the Geomancy one from XY that's been reprinted a bunch. But honestly, I think this is probably my favorite artwork for uh, the card. So that's really cool. So we've gotten two Hollows thus far, and they were Xerneas and Evil Tall. So... <laughs> Pretty interesting. 
All right, so like I said before, reverse cleft key. That's not what you said before. It's pretty neat. I, I know, because I haven't done that yet. I have not pulled a reverse cleft key. Uh, we might be hitting about half right now, I think, maybe. Yeah, that looks to be about right. It's pretty hard to tell, but all I know is we've gotten a lot of really good stuff so far. Another reverse Nidorino. That's, That's our third one. Uh, this is a Fungus Play Ball. When you play this uh, Pokemon from your hand onto your bench, you may put three Pokeball cards from your discard pile on your hand. Note that it only works with Pokeball. Uh, <laughs> so don't go ex using it trying to get like an Ultra Ball or something. It has to be Pokeball. Uh, awesome, cool. A Hollow Hydreigon to go with that Hydreigon Break that we seem to love so much. Uh, in here. So that's three hollows now. So that's pretty cool. And what I was trying to say the past like five packs or so, uh, this is about $30 more than your average box. 30 to 20 like I said, depending on where you pick the box up. So keep that in mind when we're all said and done in our tally of things. Jump Bluff is a rare, I believe. Yes. Yes, it is. I don't know if it's any good or not. Got another La Vesta. Got another Taco Bell strip Pokemon. <laughs> Seriously, that is what he looks like. Uh, Tangela. The instant noodle Pokemon. Greedy Dice and Clink. This is the most fun experiment I've ever done. Uh, nothing in this pack right here. We are definitely getting a ton of reverses. Uh, which, like I said, after that Fates box was really nice to see. A Cabalion, that is a rare, pretty good card uh, in Metal Decks. Quick Guard, uh, when it works properly on TCGO, uh, which is hardly ever, <laughs> is actually really good. So in physical play, when that stuff doesn't mess up, uh, it's actually pretty interesting. Another Klefki, we're getting all the Klefkis. Klefki is uncommon, right? Yep. There's the Fungus, Joltik, and Guard of our Spirit Link. <laughs> I'm getting my piles mixed up over here. <laughs> uh, which one does it go in? Come on, Pack. Work with me here. Ponyta, Nuzleaf, Flitwick. I don't like that Nuzleaf. What's wrong with Nuzleaf? Well, picture. First Duat, getting a garbage pile over here. <laughs> so there we go, another reverse onto the stack, and I'm gonna clean that up. <laughs> all right, all cleaned up, time to continue. <laughs> the pack train never stops. Uh, are you a rare? Yeah, you're a rare. Bastiodon. Look at that guy. Nothing's gonna bring him, Don. Ha ha ha. Huh, huh. I can't believe I'm dating you. <laughs> I can't either. <laughs> is that that Nuzzle Leaf art is kind of weird? Now you say it. Don't be hating. Are you procrastinating? Yeah. <laughs> Nothing in that pack. Come on, we haven't gotten anything good in a while. Huh. I say that we get a reverse Dino. Point still stands. We haven't gotten anything good in a while. Um, but yeah, still a ton of packs in there. I feel like this is like the Mary Poppins bag of booster boxes. Because it seriously doesn't stop. Uh, Krogonk, another Ninja Boy. I've got a lot of Ninja Boy now. <laughs> it doesn't help that like Ninja Boy is only like a one of in decks, really. And so, this pack got mutilated. Hmm. And the mutilated pack has an Avalog. Avalog's kind of interesting. Um, Yellow Swallow made a really interesting Avalog uh, mill deck uh, that I actually really liked. Um, I don't think I would ever play it because it's honestly kind of awful, but it's really funny to watch. Pokemon Ranger. It's always nice. Another kind of one of supporter in a lot of decks. 
Uh, though it was mainly a great counter to Seismitoad, and that's gone now. So uh, there's a couple cards that Ranger's good with, but its biggest threat is now. Oh, okay, good. I thought you were another Hydreigon. I was gonna throw something. <laughs> Uh, Evil Tall Break, which is not the best break in the set by any means. Uh, Xerneas is a lot better in my humble opinion. But Baleful Knight uh, for 120. Uh, stacked as 30 damage to each of your opponent's bench Pokemon that has any damage counters on it already. So toss it in a spread deck and you can be knocking out things left and right. If you're lucky. Uh, so again, not the uh, best break, but uh, definitely a cool one. And it's not Hydreigon. So it's already... A plus points in my book. Uh, Nido King. Pretty interesting card. Nido Queen, Nido King is a, in my opinion, viable fun deck. Don't think it'll ever hit the meta or anything like that. I think it's too slow for that, but uh, it's, a, it's an interesting little gimmick. Uh, nothing in that pack right there. Seriously, I feel like this doesn't end. This is the box that never <laughs> ends. Pokemon Ranger, and a reverse Shellos, and a Mantine. Let's pull a VS Seeker. Honestly, if that happened, I'd probably just die. Because that can't happen. I was going to say, that can't happen. <laughs> it's not part of this set. Exactly why I would die. Yeah. All right, another Xerneas Hollow card. Like that. Look at the Hollow, even though there's kind of very little of it on the actual card. Well, Xerneas takes up like the whole card. That's my point. Da, 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 da. Primeape, are you a rare? Yeah, you are. Cool. Oh, yeah. I remember, like the beginning of this video, you said He's like leading up Domankeys. What? What did I say? That you knew which. <laughs> I don't know anything. <laughs> I still think it's any funny. anyone that watches my content should know I know nothing. I know. I know pretty much who is it. I kind of know the rares in this set. You a rare? That <laughs> you? <laughs> that you? <laughs> it's, it's that boy. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, so we're raking in junk now, but we still got like at least like 30 packs in there, at least. <laughs> Ta-da! Jump Luff, I know you're a rare. See, I know things. It's because you already had one. I know terms. I know metrics. Nope, nope. Da -da. That's probably the stupidest thing I've ever done, and it's fantastic. It's all her fault. Yep. <laughs> Nothing in that one either. Maybe I'm at the dollar store. They got a fresh box of 120. Buy them. No, no, my voice doesn't go that deep. <laughs> There's another Nido King. They're all over this just, box. Well, we've only been stocking the dollar store for, for like the past month. I just love the fact that no one got to it. Unless I like, just put it out today. Promo pass here, right, 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 yeah. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> and I know things. Like I said, unless they, they just put it out today, which I guess is a possibility. It like wasn't even in the main display. They just like said it. Oh, yes. are you serious right now? Yes. <laughs> have we gotten four Magirnas in this box? We have two full arts, two regular. Oh come on, Pokemon! I love me Magirna, but seriously, there's a Volcanion right here that I kind of want four Indeed. of to play. I'm kind of disgruntled. I'm not gonna lie, I'm very much disgruntled. I'm curious if they just pick random stupid apol ones to go in there. I don't know what they do. Find out the box and find out. No! <laughs> <laughs> I 
Oh, why not? Why? <laughs> why? I, I, I've never been so mad at getting an EX before. <laughs> well, if this is the rate... I need the Vulcanion! If this is the rate we're going, you're going to get a Gardevoir in the next couple packs. I, I don't even want to see the audio spikes in this video right now. I'm going to have to level those out so I don't kill everybody. God dang. I mean, I'm happy we're getting EXs. And, like, I'm happy that we're kind of proving that this is a worthwhile experience. But, come on. Add some variation, bro. What was that? Get out of here. <laughs> Nothing in that pack. Holy crap. No, but seriously, it's like... If what's correct, you're gonna get another uh, verse Cabalion. That's kind of cool. Look at how shiny it is. It's not a uh, Magirna. You're correct. It's not <laughs> one. It's not an EX. Two. It's not a female metal Pokemon. Ta da! Who says Magirna's female? The fact that she has pretty flowers in her hair. Don't judge. I'm sorry, the fact that she's wearing a dress. There can be female there can be female Mr. Mimes. Can they really? I, I, I don't, don't think there was. I don't know if they still can, there used to be. Like captivating poker puff. Poker puff? Poker puff. <laughs> yep, you know what? Come on, Gardevoir. Nope. I'm waiting for it. <laughs> I'm waiting for it. It's gonna come up. Take a quick break and I'm telling your trash. It's gonna come up. Nope, going. <laughs> Okay. I'm going. Oh, uh, no. <laughs> I, at, at this point, I want the Gardevoir. I embrace the Gardevoir. <laughs> I know you're not a Gardevoir. I got two Ooh. trainers, though. That's kind of interesting. One's reverse hollow, too. Oh, my God. My piles are all over the place. That's because you keep throwing it. Well, I get emotional. <laughs> yes! <laughs> We did it! <laughs> oh, Jesus. oh Lord. My my soul is literally dying. <laughs> okay, it, we get we need another evil tall break. That's what we need right now. Yes, one evil tall break to be paired with everything. You are rare, right? Yeah, you are. Look at that Weavile. Tear away. Just like this box has torn away my soul. <laughs> I'm gonna bring these a little bit closer to the front so I don't have to keep digging. I will find you, Evil Tall Break. Ooh, it's a Moongus. You don't want to see my garbage pile right now. Look at that monstrosity I got going on over there. But no, we ain't stopping. We ain't stopping until we get that Evil Tall Break. Nope. Hmm. That ain't you. Hmm. Poke a puff. You're not even a giant death bird. Hmm. I, yeah. Need a ran. Look, it's a flaffy. It's so fluffy. We're winding down. I'm slowly losing it. I'm slowly losing it. Ah, oh, Talon Flame! Oh yeah, this box is already worth it. Got three Talon Flames. Not the fact that you've got like six to seven. Nope. Eight. Okay. Nope. Talon Flame. Got it. <laughs> None of that is an evil toll break. <laughs> Why not just pull them out of the box now? I'm on a mission. Nope, because I pulled all the other ones out of the box. I'm a. Oh oh. Yes, it's something different, and it's Volcanion. Oh snap! Hey, <laughs> I'm super quiet. I'm, I'm so happy right now. I got it, guys. Can we get another one, please? He's a full art too. I know he's pretty. Look at him. He's not the secret rare that I would. I probably would have punched something. But he, look, he's so pretty. Three of them. Three full arts. Out he's of so box. pretty. Uh, which isn't that bad. Anyway, let's continue. Get another Volcanion. Let's do it right here. 
No, you're not a Volcanion. You're a Gastrodon. Yeah, 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 I'm the same type as Volcanion. Shut up, Lit Leo. No one asks you. Calm down, Brian. What is this? Another Gastrodon. This is not shiny. <laughs> What are you down to? We're down to whatever this is. Six. Six. I can count. No, I'm pulling them all out of the thing. I already made that a point. Pulling them all out of the thing. So emotional. This garbage is taking over my everything right now. Look at this. Oh, I got that garbage. Huh. That's garbage. <laughs> I got really confused. <laughs> Try to trick me. Well, you'll never not need the Steelix Link break. I wouldn't Steelix ever need Spirit the Steelix Link. Spirit Link in the first place. Because Steelix is too expensive to build. Hmm. Mega Pokemon are like the most expensive thing to build and they're awful. Like, because you have to buy all the normal EXs and then you gotta buy the, the Mega EXs and it's just it's so many EXs. What am I doing? No, that goes to you. I was, I was waiting. Pokepuff goes in the big messy pile. All right, two more. Evil Toe Break and Volcanion EX. I can already promise you that none of that in this pack right here. There is, however, a reverse shield on Armor Fossil because that's great for life and stuff. Life and stuff. Final pack. Not gonna do is it. it. No, another Pokepuff Crikey's. Like Crikey's. Crikey's. I was going to say a lot of things right now. Alright, so we sorted everything. We got everything situated. It took way too long because I'm stupid. Yep. But <laughs> we got everything situated. So uh, fact data will be down in the description below. But I got 173 commons, 120 uncommons. Uh, that is 82 Pokemon and 38 trainers. Uh, 21 rares, 4 hollows, 3 breaks, 6 EXs, 3 full arts, and 30 reverses. Alright, so here are the 4 hollows, just to re-show everything off. Evil Tall, 2 Xerneas, and a Hydreigon. Our 3 breaks were 2 Hydreigon and an Evil Tall. As for the EXs, we got <laughs> 2 Magirna. Two Guard of War, two Mega Guard of War, a Full Art Volcanion, and two Full Art Magirnas. So we got four Magirnas <laughs> in this box. I have enough Magirnas for every single deck I could ever build. Uh, and just a quick skim through of all of the Reverse Hollows. Um, none that are like totally uh, stand out or anything like that. But uh, there was 30 of them. Evil Tull's pretty good. Cabalion's pretty good. Um, that really is about it for that. So, all in all, uh, pretty nice. Um, in terms of actual value compared to a box, uh, I still think overall you're probably better off just buying a box. Uh, the pull ratios, kind of looking at everything, uh, you get more reverses in a box. Uh, by about six. Well, no, because breaks take the place of a reverse, so we're only three shy, actually, uh, compared to a box. The EX and full art ratio is pretty close to a full box, um, if not a little bit more. Uh, Steam Siege's pull ratios in terms of a box have been really wonky, uh, so I think we actually, in terms of EXs and full arts, did better than a normal box. Uh... It's really hard to say, uh, for sure, but in my humble opinion, I think we did a little bit better uh, than a normal box. Hollows, we got a little bit less than a full box, because Steam Siege is full of hollows. Uh, so really, it depends on where you stand. I think if we would have got a little bit more variety uh, in this box, instead of whatever this is, uh, then it totally would have been really, uh, really beneficial. But uh, So there you have it. There's our data. Uh, take that as you will. If this is worth it to you to go and try to raid an entire Dollar Tree of their big old box of 120 packs, and by all means do it. The look on the cashier's faces are priceless. <laughs> so there we go. I did that.
that, that this is a thing that actually happened. Uh, so hopefully uh, you all enjoyed. Will I do it again for evolutions? I don't know. No, 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 you will. Oh, okay. I will, I guess. So stay tuned for another 120 pack opening for evolutions when it comes out this November. Uh, but that about does it for this unboxing. Hope you enjoyed. It was a lot of fun. It got really crazy towards the end because I was slowly losing my sanity. But it was well, well worth it. Uh, this was a lot of fun. You were only slowly losing your slowly. sanity? Slowly. Oh, oh. Slowly losing the sanity. Oh, okay. So that about does it for this unboxing. If you like it, go ahead and bless that like button, comment below, and subscribe for more. So as always, thanks for watching. Take care. And have a great one. Bye. Bye-bye. I'm going to take my four McGuinness and go. No, no, they're mine. Uh.